Hi there. We are at the J and Ding Darling National Wildlife Refuge on Sanibel Island. And we are about to go on a four mile loop bike ride through the refuge. There's also an eight mile loop bike ride you can do. It costs a buck to get in for your bike. Not bad. A buck a bike, 10 bucks a car. Look, baby. That is snook. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Snook, baby. Huh? Mm, baby. There they are. You got a measuring. What's it taste like? A whitefish? He's really good. His mouth is really, um, weird. It's like... He's like a big bass. Yeah! I was just gonna say that. Gotta be a lot bigger than that, doesn't he? Oh no. I stand in the white stuff. Now I get to do my most favorite thing in the whole world, which is jump off the back of the boat. Let's hope she looked at the tide before she went in. Current take her away. That's salty. Yeah, you think? It's very salty. Very cold. Oh. Oh. All right. It's good. It's great. Uh, I mean, water's fine after you get used to it. I'm coming in. A little busy out here. The boat's coming every direction you can think of. Behind us, in front of us, on the side. It's a little crazy. Glad Steven's driving. Where are we, you say? We are Sandville Island. We had great sailing all the way back to Marco Island. Just take her out side of the beach area, Marco Island, and this is a perfect spot, man. Gotta be here in the right wind, as always, but it's beautiful. And uh, the moon rise tonight was amazing. That little spot there. Uh, I'm gonna have to look that up. That's a happening place. Look at that deck on that. It's awesome. And it moves right over. I took a uh, project we got going on this morning, bird deterrent.
Nothing but bird deterrent. As you can see, the birds are killing me. They uh, come up here and get these palmetto seeds or something, and grapes or something. Stand on top of my mask, peel them, eat them, poop them. Poop, poop, poop. This is this isn't even bad. <clears throat> so I'm trying to stop them doing everything I can. Change my halyards, change my top and lift, so they can't sit there and light on it. 75 feet up to the top. I took the topping lift off. You see, I put that board back there to support the boom. And now I'm going back up the mast one more time because they're lighting right on the very, very top of the boom. There's just enough room up there for about four or five of them, but I got some for them. Oh yes, I do. I'm going up there with my new made medieval torture device. You see that? Uh -huh. Took fishing wire, bent it on the bottom, dropped drilled holes in there, dropped them in the bottom, duct taped it on the bottom. I'm gonna try to duct tape this to the very top of the mast. They land on that. <laughs> Here we go. Top of the mast. Hey, maybe I'll take a picture while I'm up there. Okay, we're gonna try to get some video here of my medieval torture device. It's very hard for me to hold the phone, so. This is what it looks like up here on top of the mast. It's hard to get a good picture without dropping the phone, so. That's about it in the meantime. There's some footage of POI. Okay, so it's shaking a little bit. That's because I'm shaking a little bit. I don't like to look around when I'm up here. This video turns out. My fingers are in the way on some of it. Pretty cool though. I hear the birds. Three forty eights in a row. Huh. Hey, here's me. Why Christmas? Well, it's only three months away, less than three months away. Gotta get ready. 
subscribe to our channel and hit the alert to get notified of our next video. Thanks for watching.